in this video, we prove that the only subspaces of R1 is the set that just contains 0 and the set R1 itself. So first, how about we prove that both of these are subspaces of R1 and then we'll show that nothing else is. So, the set that just contained 0, it is a subset of R1, which is a vector space. So, to show that this is a vector space, so to show that that's the vector space, all we have to do is show that it's closed under addition and it's closed under scalar multiplication. Well, there's only one vector in it. So when I add these, I now think of these both being an R for a moment. When I add them, I get back the zero vector. Actually, since it's in R1, it's the number zero. So this is, this is true. So this is true in R1, which implies that this vector is closed, is this set is closed under circle plus. Now, if you take the scalar, and you multiply it by 0 in R, you get back 0. Okay. But I got back into this set, it turned out. This is true in R1 for all vectors in this set. This implies that this set is closed under circle dot. We are allowed to conclude then that this is a subspace of R1. Okay, now let's show that R1 is a subspace of R1. Well, it's a subset of a vector space. Ah, so all I have to do is show that it's a close under a plus and minus. So let X and Y be in R1. Well, that implies x plus y is in R1. It's in that R1. Oh, that's the same set. So it's in R1, which implies that R1 is closed under addition. Let's see be any real number. So C, circle, star, X. This is in R1 because C is a scalar, a real number, and X is in R1. And since R1 is a vector space, it's closed. So this implies that R1 is closed under circle dot. So again, we conclude uh, yeah, we conclude that R1 is a vector is a subspace is a subspace of itself. And that's always true. If V is a vector space, then V is 
the subspace of V. Now, so let's see. We showed that that's a vector space. We showed R1 is a vector space. Well, let me take that back. We showed that the, their set that just contains zero is a su subspace of R1. And we showed that the set R1 is a subspace of R1. But those are supposed to be the only two. Okay. So let's pick something in between. Pick X in R1 such that um, the empty set, the set that contains zero, hmm, is a subset of X which is a proper subset of R1. Okay? So I'm picking something in between here and here. And if I conclude that X is the set that contains zero or X is equal to, is X equals the set that contains zero or X equals R1, I'm done. Okay. So, there must exist an x other than 0 such that x is in big X. Okay. Now, x is a real number. x is a subset of R1. It's a real number. It's the set of the subset. Little x is a real number. Okay. So now consider consider 1 over x circle dot with x. This is the scalar. It's a real number. That means it's in R. This is in R. So, their circle dot is in R. But, but, 1 over x circle x is 1. Is 1. Okay, because, because this is nothing more than x inverse. And multiplication in x1 circled, okay, that's 1. Now, 1 is in x because it's closed. For it to be a vector space or a subspace, I guess I should say that X is a subspace of R1. Okay, so now if 1 is a subspace, then any real number, let K be any element of R. Well then, k times 1, which is equal to k, that's in x. Because it's closed. This is in x. But that implies that x is equal to r1. That implies that x is equal to r1. And we were wrong when we, so, you know, we were wrong when we said it was less than. It has to equal, not even be a subset of. It must be equal.
So we tried to pick something in between those two sets and we fit and we failed. There is no subspace between the two. It turned out that the one that we're, the arbitrary one that we picked turned out to equal R1. So we prove that the set that just contains zero is a vector, is a subspace of R1. We prove that R1 is a subspace of R1 and nothing else. These are the only two subspaces of R1. Is that going to be true of R2 and R3? Let me know. This completes this video. If you like videos like this, please subscribe to my channel. Once again, as always, watch and learn.